Spectacular eruption from new stone thermal vent near Norris Geyser Basin lures tourists ahead of park reopening in Wyoming. Yellowstone National Park, known the world over for its mesmerizing geysers and bubbling mud pots, recently welcomed a spectacular new addition, a steam-belching thermal vent near the Norris Geyser Basin. Located about a mile north of the popular tourist attraction, the fresh geological feature promises visitors unprecedented views from a convenient roadside parking lot when the park reopens to vehicles in April. While new thermal features in Yellowstone are relatively common due to the park's active volcanic nature, what sets this particular vent apart is its unusual visibility. Travelers don't have to take a long hike or traverse rugged terrain to witness nature's geothermal spectacle. It can be admired from the comfort of a roadside parking lot. Park geologists first identified the steam belching phenomenon last summer. Researchers from the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory part of the U.S. Geological Survey, scoured the swampy area to investigate, finding steam temperatures reaching 171 degrees Fahrenheit, 77 degrees Celsius, emanating from the base of a heavily forested hillside. A thin layer of fresh gray mud around the vent conclusively confirmed its newness. Geologists have traced the new steam plume to a larger area of geothermal activity that stretches about 200 feet across. Notably, the layer appears to be linked to another thermal event that occurred 700 feet away in 2003, in which hot water dramatically erupted, marking the park's growing geothermal landscape. However, experts have indicated that the new vent has significantly diminished during recent winter months. Its long-term visibility and level of activity throughout the upcoming tourist season remain uncertain, adding another layer of uncertainty for eager visitors. Mike Poland, chief scientist at the Yellowstone Volcano Observatory, stressed that such thermal events are not uncommon in Yellowstone's active geothermal environment. Poland assured the public that the sudden appearance of new thermal vents is a normal and recurring phenomenon. While dramatic, they do not signal an increased volcanic threat or an imminent eruption. Despite this, Yellowstone's geothermal features remain under constant scientific scrutiny. The park is known for sitting atop a vast volcanic system that has historically been responsible for monumental eruptions. The last significant eruption occurred about 631,000 years ago, and while the volcano has remained dormant in terms of lava activity for the past 70,000 years, its vast magma chamber continues to fuel Yellowstone's iconic geothermal phenomena. Located beneath the depths ranging from 5 to 10 miles, 8 to 16 kilometers, Yellowstone's magma chamber continually heats underground water, which powers the park's thousands of geysers, hot springs, fumaroles, and mud pots. Current geological estimates suggest that only about 10% to 30% of this underground chamber contains liquid magma. This partial magma recharge significantly reduces the likelihood of a volcanic eruption, providing reassurance to the millions of people who visit Yellowstone. In the summer of 2024, visitors to Yellowstone witnessed a remarkable hydrothermal eruption, a vivid illustration of the park's active geothermal dynamics. Hot water and debris erupted dramatically, briefly unsettling visitors but ultimately causing no lasting damage. Geologists continue to emphasize that while this dramatic natural spectacle captured the public's imagination, it did not indicate an immediate volcanic threat.
Yellowstone's dynamic geologic history underscores the constant evolution of its geothermal features. Even the park's most famous attraction, Old Faithful, known worldwide for its predictable geyser eruptions, sometimes changes in intensity and timing. Such shifts further illustrate the living, breathing nature of Yellowstone's thermal landscape. Yellowstone tourism stakeholders and local businesses eagerly await the increased visitor numbers that this new, accessible geothermal attraction will bring.